welcome to another episode of Nerd Out! Today we are Starscream Crazy. Um, I was able to hunt down the Toys R Us masterpiece. Can I tell the story of how you, you got can, it? You can, please, go Let for it. Let me tell it. that story. All right. Love so anyway, I've been looking for this thing for weeks. Right, which you could have gotten in Japan uh, yeah, I could have got years yep. ago. Yeah, I could have no, got right. it in Japan for a... 160 I paid bucks. 160 yeah. bucks too. But years it comes with a coronation set, which is right. cool and all that. Oh, yeah, I never even thought about that. But it, this was out two weeks ago, Toys R Us. Now, literally, I've been going twice a day for two weeks looking for it. Right? I gave up. I'm like, fuck it. I'm done. I can't do this anymore. I can't I can't do it. I was really getting you discouraged. Were getting I was discouraged. I was. I was down about it. So, anyways, he hits it up yesterday, finds one that's that's on hold. And, and, and swing some sack at it and gets it out of there, man. Manned up, got it out of there, put the resources in, and yeah, I'm eternally yep. grateful for yes. this because I love this thing. Absolutely, I was so excited. They yeah. had it. They had it behind the counter, and I'll be honest with you, there was no way I wasn't gonna get that. Like I was gonna start. A, I was gonna. I was gonna throw a Randy fit if they uh, if they didn't sell it to me. But um, you got it, and I. I you got it. I just own it now. Well, you paid for it. So yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I Honestly. see what you're saying. I got, I get the glory of you got the, yeah, but you but got the throw of the hunt. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I enjoyed that. That's good. But uh, my biggest thing is, I, I just want to before before you start going on and about this, I just want to say like when I got the one the Takara version uh, two years ago, I was less than impressed. As a matter of fact, mm -hmm. I re I really didn't I really didn't like. I paid 160 bucks. I like the new head, and I'm gonna say flat out, I I don't care for the. Uh, the the I like the old school kibble. I prefer the kibble. I like it. The only thing I didn't like about the old one is the head. Um, but I think the the Takara one uh, gray is swirly. It's got that swirly cheap plastic, and uh, I I was I was done with. It. I'm bored with it. But um, so I'm not gonna argue that mm -hmm. this does definitely have quality hits as compared to the first issue one. But what they did improve upon is the feet. You mm -hmm. gotta give the feet because it I can do. stand on its own. I do agree. And all that. But um, you know, as far as reviewing comparing this to the other mold, I mean it, it's like, you know, it's it's almost identical to, to this one, minus a blue nose cone. Yes, which I like the blue nose cone. I, I, That's one nice nose cone you got there. I like the blue nose cone too, and I think the blues are tiny. Tiny but different. And then one uh the Takara one has a glossy hat. Yep. Yep. And which one do you like? Which head do you like better? You know what? I think the glossy one. I think so too. It just, it just makes it, adds, it look more expensive. Yeah, it looks more painted. Mm -hmm. It looks painted. And um, oh yeah, also the red on this matches perfectly. Here it's a little off. The the reds. Yeah, the don't Hasbro, match. the crotch particularly. Yeah. Yep. Looks, look, looks off. Um, now like this is a. Uh, I have a, I'm trying to think of how to get to this. Do you have anything else you want to say? Oh, um, I do want to say... Uh, I think I'm going to rub my balls all over your star screen. Uh, for just right off the bat, like, uh, $160 is a steal for it. Like, I was bitching about it. I was like, I don't understand why people, why you care so much about this. Like, who cares? Who cares? We've had this mold so many times. And that's at $160. At $60, I got to say, I'm like, all right, that's worth $60. It's, mm -hmm. it's a good price. Um, but other than that, like, you know, just, it, it looks good. I'm just sick of the mold. I'm done with it. The whole I'm thing is, though, you've had the good one for two years. Two years, right. Like, I haven't. And I've I don't know if I can see the good one. I've had everything but right. the good one. Right. You know, I had the, the sudden storm, yeah, which acid storm. Shit. Yeah, they're pieces of shit. The, uh, the, uh, thundercracker, well, which is. Yeah, you, you actually. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It, it could have been, it could have been. But this is the one to have, you know? And it's like, you know, I got it. And yeah, it's an older mold, but it's like, and it's so repopped. But this one is the one that, yeah. it's it's the one to get. And it, and it really sort of added some new life mm -hmm. to it for me. And what's weird is this is actually made, like, with better tolerances and stuff than the acid storm and the sunstorm. Yeah. Like, those fall apart for me. They don't stay together. They're not tight. Like, these things always fall off on them. These haven't fallen off yet. They're, like, really on there. Oh, really? Mine still fall off, even my Takara one. Really? Yeah. So, and, and and it's just, like, you know, I think we're so hard on this thing because it's been popped so many times. That's the thing. Many it's, times. Yeah, it's just so old. It's, like, I, I, mean, I think I if you, I think if mm -hmm. you stepped in as an outsider right. and looked oh, at yeah. Transformers yeah. Masterpiece, it's beautiful. this would be, like, a very revered yeah. mold. I think it's sweet. It's a great mold. It's just, like... 
Okay, Ben, they're done then. Mm -hmm. They should have just made this. Right. And the other two Seekers and been done. And, been done and, and not released yeah. the junky colors that nobody likes. Because it really does bring this thing down a little bit. Mm -hmm. Like, if it's they only yeah. popped this a couple of times, I think, you know, it, but I guess they want to make money. You know what feature on the, on the newer mold that I actually thought I would like more than I don't is how the missiles are connected. Yeah. Like, I think yeah. that's a really inventive idea. Yeah, but it, it's useless. Yeah, it, it is. It's actually frustrating. Um, I heard... That all of them come packaged with the fingers backwards. You said, oh, you, yeah, yeah, mine did. Andy mine said, did, yeah. That. Andy said his did too. Okay. Um, and I also heard he said that there was a problem with uh, something about the crotch not holding in properly. Is there? Did you notice an issue? Uh, maybe. I mean, uh, I don't know. Yeah. It doesn't go in perfect, but yeah. Comparison wise, like I can definitely like. I mean, I I still I still like the Walmart exclusive better, the best, except for the head. I hate this head sculpt. Um. But that is definitely the nicest one they've made. Yeah, I mean, like, without a doubt. Just, right. Like it's better than the original one. It's just the weathering on it is nice. Mm -hmm. It looks mean. It does. Uh, I just I think the gray plastic is, is where I uh, got most frustrated. Swirly. Yeah. It just it looks cheap. It, it it looks it doesn't look masterpiece mm -hmm. quite. But uh, I'm glad you got it. I'm glad you're happy you got it. Um, also, this is like bright early in the morning. We just saw pictures of the masterpiece hot rod and shockwave and uh just real quick brian and i made a bet about yeah. eight months ago i said that that um has takara would come announce on, on, on. it was not eight months ago no it was like two years ago no it wasn't it was, it was right was after no my way. heart issue it was before i no. had the yf19 it was we were at a toy show with andy and uh <laughs> in, in, in... <coughs> you all right there cap get it out, get it out. We're gonna. We, we, we were waiting in line at a toy show at uh, <coughs> at some center at Macomb Macomb Community College show. We're standing in line. That's right. And and I said that I believe Shockwave will come out by 2017, and um or announced. Mm -hmm. And you said it wouldn't. And so we made a bet. And the bet was if I win the bet, I get a Shockwave purchased by you. And your your was you'd get something equivalent to that. And. Uh, I lost that bet. That you lost I, that I bet. I lost that bet. And, and hopefully that's good news for it both of us. It is good news. Yeah. It does, it does render your Quake Waves completely useless. Uh, you know, I don't know what you do with them. I mean, you might keep you them. You know what? I mean, I, I don't know. They still have to beat the Quake that's Waves. That's true. Well, they just showed pictures, the colored pictures, and I think that they were off on the purple. I think Shockwave needs to be that um, plum purple, that really dark deep purple and it looks like they're going for a, sort of a lighter animated purple. you'll get both you think That's so i don't, I don't really yeah, want you both you won't get the diaclone I, I know it's not diaclone the, radio, the shack wave well that too but oh. i don't think you'll get the purple color one you'll get that one second they'll they'll give you three of them they'll i think, give you that cartoon one but the cartoon yeah the toy I don't want the and then one. they'll get a shack wave uh, i don't want a cartoon one man i, I want the dark deep purple but like, everybody else wants the cartoon deep purple one. I know because well, wait, do you I think know. they do? What do you think is more popular, the cartoon the one or the toy? cartoon one? I, probably. Okay. The problem is, is uh, I I, re I rely on Hasbro to do the cartoon colors. I want Takara to do the like the dark. Color. Yeah, yeah, but unfortunately, it looks like it's going to be lighter. And I hope the the gun hand lights up, but I'm not sure if it's going to. If it's going to have electronics, it looks it looks good from I the think pictures. It will for 174 dollars. That's not that much though. You're right. That's I, a actually, lot. that is. I mean, it's not. It's like it's not like no, oh, I can't right. afford it. But Ultra right. Magnus was about that same price, so it better have. Some we got Ultra Magnus for like 100. 150, 140 shit. Yeah, like that was like, a good price. But yeah, they're charging Ultra Magnus prices for yeah. this thing. It's going to be intense. Yeah, mm -hmm. but the pictures look good. Yeah. My, my thoughts are that like when we, when you got Quake Wave, I was like, I like this. But it doesn't look masterpiece. Like I expect the masterpiece one to blow it away. And judging by the pictures, I'm not so sure that it's doing that. Uh, I think Quake Wave kind of looks. I mean, it still looks a little bit more just um, chunky. I mean, yeah. you know. But I think they just made him a good toy. He's yeah. a fun toy, you know, to muck around with. Right. Yeah. I mean, I'll get both. But you know what? I mean, I'm like, more excited about Hot Rod. Me too. Me too. Yeah. I think he'll be sweet. His upper body looks a little huge, but. We'll get through. Yeah, it. yeah, but I, I think it looks. I, I think it was a big. Uh, I think one of the, one of the big things about it is the fact that they eliminated the whole hot rod to Rodimus gives them such a better opportunity yeah, more to make, a better to make it good. Yeah, yeah. I uh, hated that feature. I did too. I I really do. Like I I actually defend the Rodimus figure, but like it is not fun to play with. Mm -hmm. It is dated, and uh, I really want a smaller scale. 
hot rod figure, and I'm excited about it. I'm, I'm excited. excited I can play with my Rodimus now, and I yeah. about busting it, because I don't care. Okay. You know? I, I have two of them, but I have the Japanese one, which I can't touch, because that thing will crumble if I look at it in a wrong way. But, uh, Masterpiece, uh, track should be out next month. I'm excited for it, but I'm, I'm getting nervous about that, too. We've been saying it's coming out next month. Yeah, I know, long, man. For the last six months. Yeah, wow. Well, I'm excited. I'm excited yeah. for just a normal Masterpiece toy. Absolutely. Oh, goodness. May God. Maybe we're finally getting, uh, getting the ball rolling on Masterpiece. Yeah. But, uh, with that said, what else? Do you have anything else you want to say on that star screen? You You're know, so, I, like, excited. Thanks. I mean, that. But, yeah. uh, I dig it, man. I dig it a lot. You know, if you guys are like everyone else and have the Sunstorm and the Acid oh, Storm. just throw those in the trash. Throw those in the trash and get this. It's yeah. not the same toy. By any means, it's it's not. It, like, I know it's just painted differently, but but it's such a strong difference. It, it, it really is a new toy. And it, like, if you have those molds, you don't have Star Right, Street. right. It definitely you know? is the character that, that yep. makes it so significant, I think. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I, I admit, uh, I'm done with the mold. I'm actually hoping that they this they will retire it. I don't need any more um, Star Screen One more. Seekers. No, they need to do the American... Uh, Skywarp? Yeah, and, and then they, they really done. done. Yeah, I, I can see that point. But, well, but... they did the two of them, I mean... Do that. Well, two more, and then ice storm. Man, I wish that they. And then they're done. Yeah, I don't want what. I don't, I don't want, want it storm. either. But what for useless. completists, you know, I mean, I, I don't even know I, where ice storm is from. I mean, I consider myself me a pretty transformer heavy, uh, heavy transformer fan, and I don't know what the fucking ice they're storm from the is. Comic book. Uh, I think man, they were in them. useless. But they, they had some weird, the car the cartoon had like characters that you never there was a green star screen. yes but was actually it, I think that I think that's what Acid Storm, Storm yeah, was yeah. I think that's where its origins and, and are and same as Ice Storm and all that it was just bad animation I, I really I really wish I could justify buying those those Asia exclusive Skywarp because the paint mm -hmm. job uh, Nick has yeah. one and it's beautiful it's just I can't justify paying two hundred dollars for another one of these molds. yeah exactly no way exactly no way sixty bucks yeah 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 man. 60 bucks yeah. I, I, is a home run, man. Yeah. Uh, hopefully it'll be the last well, seeker you get. So uh, other than that, um, I think uh, Martian this weekend. I'm going to see the Martian. Yeah. Hopefully this is the return to Ridley Scott, uh, the, his form of the Blade Runner and in, in, in his movie. Or it's going to be terrible. But I don't think it's going to be terrible. I think it's going to be good, but I don't think... I, I don't think the magic could ever return back to Ridley Scott the way that his magic, no, no. you know, his aura in the, in the early 80s, late 70s. Mm. But uh, uh, hopefully we see that and we, we have a conversation about that. So uh, if you find the Star Scream for 60 bucks, pick it up. It's worth it. Subscribe, like, check our Instagram. Comment. Comment. Go to MotorCityToyStore.com, type in the promo code NERDOUT, and you can get 5% off of your order right now. And everybody, have fun. Nerd out! Nerd out! Your nose cone is so big.